Welcome to Accreditation 101. The University of the District of Columbia is preparing for its self and peer assessment, a process called accreditation. The purpose of accreditation is to validate UDC's academic quality and the continuous improvements as well as public accountability. This video provides an overview of the basic elements of accreditation. What is accreditation? Accreditation is the comprehensive evaluation of all aspects of a university's mission and its effectiveness as an institution of higher education. Now all colleges and universities go through an initial accreditation process. In fact, UDC is already accredited. But universities must reaffirm their accreditation every eight years. Our accreditation will occur in 2025, but it takes over two years to prepare for the on-site visit and evaluation. We prepare by conducting a self-study. charge of accreditation. Our accrediting organization is called the Middle States Commission of Higher Education, or Middle States for short. So how does evaluation work? How does the Middle State assess the value of the UDC experience? Well, Middle States will evaluate UDC based on seven standards of accreditation. Each of the seven standards of accreditation includes a definition and criteria that must be met that will be evaluated by the Middle States. Each standard has four to nine specific criteria for a total of 46 criteria. For example, standard one, the mission and goals, the evaluators are looking to see that UDC's mission defines its purpose within the context of higher education, the student it serves, and it intends to accomplish. The institution's stated goal should clearly be linked to its mission and specify how the institution fulfills its mission. Hey, now pay attention. This is for you. In Standard 4, Support of the Student Experience, the university is assessed on the policies and processes to admit, retain, and facilitate the success of students. Here, policies and practices around tuition, scholarships, financial aid, and advising are reviewed. UDC will also evaluate its policies and procedures regarding the acceptance of transfer credits, athletics, other student activities, as well as supporting services such as tutoring. This is just a sample of what one standard contains. So you may ask, why is accreditation important to me? Well, it is really important because accreditation affirms that your university provides a quality education that validates your degree. This validation makes it easier for your credits to be transferred if you move on to another university. Now don't do that. If you choose to go on to graduate school, your chances of being accepted are higher because you graduated from a regionally accredited institution. How can you contribute? There are two crucial elements in the accreditation process. One is student involvement, and two is student voices. We need student leaders to share information with other students and encourage them to learn more about the accreditation process. 
We need students to attend accreditation planning meetings. We need students to contribute to our self-study by answering surveys, participating in focus group discussions, and sharing experiences, good or challenging, with your student leaders, faculties, and advisors. It is important that you are confident that your voices have been heard throughout the process. Check my UDC for update. Our motto is aspire, accomplish, take on the world. Your contribution to the accreditation process matters. Let's do it.